Gadget Jeff. Beep beep. Hey, welcome back YouTube to another exciting Gadget Jeff TV video. A channel dedicated to things I truly love gadgets and toys and i'm going to be showing and telling you something very near and dear to my heart guns guns how can we make this better but in all seriousness guns are nothing to play around with i purchased this gun because well badass shoots 223 size bullets at a rate of up to 2500 feet per second yeah, that's moving. What's even more awesome is most AR-15s have high capacity magazines, or also referred to as clips, capable of holding up to 30 rounds of ammunition. This is why the military uses them. They're accurate, fast, and efficient. You can get these guys from anywhere from 800 bucks up to 1500 bucks. They even have super cool accessories you can use to really bring up the price if you feel up to it. Sights, laser scopes, flashlights, extra magazine holders, different rails, I mean, you name it, you can go crazy on these things. Da, 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 da. Meet the Glock, a semi-automatic pistol capable of shooting as fast as you can pull the trigger. Mine here shoots a 45 caliber bullet. Yeah, look at that mean little sucker. Capable of traveling over 1,000 feet per second and with a tremendous amount of stopping power. <laughs> Actually, the Glock is one of the most popular handguns in the world, with more than 350,000 of them sold to 45 different countries since 1992. 250,000 of those within the United States. Eek, that's a lot of guns. Designed and made in Austria, the Glock is the top picks for most law enforcement agencies. Hey, if it's good enough for police, it's good enough for me. Depending on the clip size, most Glocks can hold up to 13 rounds in the clip and one in the chamber, equaling 14 total. Depending on the size, you can get these suckers for about four to five, six hundred dollars used. Actually, the first gun ever produced was from the Song Dynasty back in 500 AD. The trend of the invention of guns progressed tremendously since then. Over the years, machine guns came into existence. Actually, the man who invented the first machine gun was a dude named James Puckle. He was a lawyer and writer from London who invented the defense gun, or popularly known as the Puckle gun, and would shoot about nine rounds per minute. <laughs> and I know what you're thinking. Isn't that the gun that Arnold used in the Terminator? Actually, no. That was called a minigun, or referred to as a Gatling gun, and can shoot up to 6,000 rounds per minute. Yeah. That came a little bit later in life with technology. Yeah, but I really don't know why they call it the minigun. I mean, that thing was crazy. It was even in the Matrix. They should have called it the Mega Gun. Hey, thanks for checking out my first video, guys. I hope you had a good time and possibly learned something. I still have plenty and plenty of crazy gadgets and toys to show you, so please stay tuned. And if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment below and also hit that subscribe button. <laughs>